we don't want big numbers make it simple make it simple there are two things are there one is primary and one is secondary your expenses depreciation rent lighting power supervision fire insurance A warm welcome to one and all. This is your Adha Sir here, lecturing with the Ashram Fashgat College, the Temple of Excellence. Now we are discussing your Unit Five, Session Two of your Cost Accounting, the topic called Overhead. In the previous session, I gave you brief introduction about what is overhead and under overhead, what are the concept like the basis and allocations like advertisement we should go for sales. Carriage inward should go for sales. Purchases. Carriage outward should go for sales. Number of employee like your food expenses, canteen expenses should be on the basis of number of employees. Manager's salary again number of employees and your area occupied for the rent purpose. Electricity number of lighting point. All these things we discussed in the previous session. If you have not watched the previous session. Please go back, watch, then you come back for this particular session. Then only you will get continuity. Now, in today's session, we work out one complete problem that is like your question paper problem itself. So we are not doing any basic problems here. All what we are doing, everything your question paper problems itself. So your problem number one. So the format I have not given for this, there is no format. But while doing this particular problem, I'll explain you how you are supposed to do this particular problem. Format is not required. While doing this, you will only understand how to do this particular problem. Major Sunshine Steel Industry has three production department and two service department. The actual cost for a period are as follows. Now, in this. Sunshine Steel Industry has three production department and also we call it as two service department. There are two things are there, production department as well as service department. Then, so first one, depreciation, rent, lighting, power, supervision charges, fire insurance. Now, these are the expenses. This has to be apportioned. I'll tell you the concept. Example, you have how much you pay depreciation 6000, how much you pay rent, lighting, power, supervision, life insurance, investment of stock. I'll give you best example, just assume that there is a small room or a house, there is a small house, how many are there in that house, assume that three production department, two service department, production and service, it will be three, it will be two all put together we call it as five assume that it is a small house how many members are there five members are there now whatever the expenses they made rent electricity power supervision insurance whatever expenses they made it has to be paid by whom all the five members hope you are clear these like six thousand has to be paid by all five twelve thousand should be paid by all five all five in the sense, 6,000 should be paid equally by all five members. What about 12,000 paid by five members? Everything is divided for five members. Now, this amount is not paid by one member. 6,000, 12, 7,200, 3,600. It is distributed, bifurcated by all these five members. Similarly, all these five department. Now, so in this, the question is very simple. We have 6,000 here. In this 6,000, how much first person should pay? How much second person? How much third person? How much fourth person? And how much fifth person supposed to pay? That is the question. 6,000 we have. So how much each will pay in this? Now, you cannot divide equally, so everybody will pay 1,200 equally, no. Why? Because we have to see how much the rent 
depreciation means how much this person used how much this person used how much this person used depreciation normally on what machinery or furnitures so according to the usage of individual we have to distribute this amount hope you are clear and one more example i'll give you rent it is 12000 how many members are there five members are there if each pay 1400 something so you will get this 12 thousand but what happens here means this person used only this this person used this much area this one used this this and this see person two used almost most of the area but still can you divide equally no according to the size of the land they have used they are supposed to distribute this 12,000 hope you got it now very good. I'll tell you how to distribute and everything. Your job is what? You have to see all the expenses. You have to divide to these five members according to what? According to in case of rent, area occupied, how much this person occupied, how much this person occupied, according to that you are supposed to distribute. Depreciation, value of the asset. How much this person use? Like you have a bike. I use only for one hour. You are using for 10 hours. Then what happens? You have to pay more depreciation. Why? Because the usage is more by you. Hope you are clear. Good. Now, so the following information available in the respect of all the five departments. Still we are in the question only. What is this statement or box means? As I told you, rent we have to distribute how on the base of area occupied how much this person how much this person used those information given in this hope you are clear see area a has used 500 square feet b has used 4 6 3 2 according to this we are supposed to distribute your rent now light point light point for what purpose electricity Whatever electricity you paid, lighting you paid, 12,000. This 12,000 should be distributed according to light point they have used. Hope you are clear. Yes. Read this as 10, 20. Then HP machine for what purpose? Power chargers. See you have power chargers. This should be on the basis of what? HP of machine. So horse power. HP stands for horse power. 70, 20, 20 as well as 10. Similarly, value of machine. Value of machine for what purpose? Depreciation. See, you have taken depreciation on the base of what? Value of machine. A is using only 20,000, 18,000, 12,000, 4,000, 6,000. These are the bifurcations we have. Then, value of stock. Value of stock. In this, what happens? 50,000, 30,000, 20,000, 10,000 as well as 10,000. These are the bifurcations. Then number of employees, 40, 20, 30, 10 and 20. Number of employees for what reason? Supervision charges should be distributed among number of employees. How I know that? Supervision for number of employees, rent for area occupied. How do I know? How do I know means go back to your previous session in that I have explained you what for what. Hope you are clear. Good. Now in this what happens what you are supposed to do is first you have to before you bifurcate you have to simplify this. The numbers are big. We don't want big numbers. Make it simple. Make it simple. That is called as working note. Whatever numbers they have given, we are making it as simple. How? Now, 500, 400, 600, 300, 200. 5, 4, 6, 3, 2. So, how you will simplify? You have to see, it should go in a single table. Like you can go for 100. 100, 5, 100, 4, 106, 103, 102. Hope you got it. Yes. Now, what is the total of this? 5 plus 4 plus 6 plus 3 plus 2, the answer is 
20. Hope you are clear. Good. Similarly, now light point. How do you work out light point? Simple. 20, 40, 30, 210. It is not 200. Take it as 20. Now, if you simplify this, you can go with the table 10. 2, 4, 3, 2, 1. The answer is 12. Similarly, your machinery, whatever given in the question, the same thing we copied, we are simplifying that because we don't want big numbers, we want small numbers. Now, 70, 20, 20, 10 and nil. So in the question also nothing is given. So we consider as zero. Now, if you simplify this, 7, 2, 2, 1 and nil, that total is 12. Similarly, you are 20,000, 18,000, 12,000, 4,000. Again, you can simplify with 10,000 uh, itself or 2,000. From 2,000, it is 10, 9, 6, 2. Just simplify with a single table. Similarly, 5, 3, 2, 1. Similarly, 4, 2, 3, 1. The total is, yes, the total is 20. Total is 12, 30, 12. Yes. So these are the simplification we have done so far. Any doubt in this working note? We have not yet started your answer. What we did, we did only whatever given in the question, we made it simplified number. How did we do? In a single table, we tried to simplify. Hope you are clear. In case, in case, Sir, we don't know to do this calculation. I don't know to simplify. Then what can I do? I can take the same number, 500, 400, 600, 300. But if it is for 10 or 15 marks, you will lose 5 marks for not doing this process. Your answer will be correct, but you will lose 5 marks for not doing this working note. Now, once if it is done, now come to your answer. What is your answer? First column is expenses. Second column, basis of apportionment. Third, total, production department and service department. Under production, we have A and B, C. Under service department, X and Y. Hope you are clear. Yes. Now what you are supposed to do? You have to write all the expenses. Go back to your question. Your expenses, depreciation, rent, Lighting, power, supervision, fire insurance. Write all the thing. Depreciation, rent, lighting, power, supervision, fire insurance in as per of stock. Hope you are clear. Yes. What is the next column? Basis of allocation. Now, depreciation comes, which one comes for depreciation? Value of machinery. Rent comes for what? You have to search in this, you will get it area occupied and lighting for lighting point, power HP of machine, supervision number of employees, fire insurance, it is value of stock. You have to check there itself. There itself you are supposed to check, you will get answer for this. Hope you are clear. Good. Now, so I got answer for all this. Later, what is the next procedure? The next procedure is your expenses. It is already given in the question. See, 6, 6 12, 12, 48, 7.2, 3600. Copy, paste. 6000, 12, 12, 48, 7.2, 3000. What is the total? 88,800. Now, for value of machine, go back. You have done working note. Yes. Where is value of machine? Here. What is the simplified number? 10, 9, 6, 2, 3, the total is 12. So take this value of machine 10, 9, 6, 2, 3. Similarly, area occupied, lighting, HP, number of employee, value of stock, take everything, the simplified value we have taken. Up to this, there is no doubt expenses, basis of apportionment, no doubt, total also, no doubt. Then, production department, service department. Now, 
Now, how to classify this? The classification is very simple. What you are supposed to do is, how much is your expenses? 6,000. Take 6,000. Multiplied with, what is for A? For A, it is 10. So, multiplied with 10, divided by 10 plus 9, 19. Plus 5, 25. Plus 2, 27. 27 plus 3, 30. Divided by 30. You will get this answer. Hope you are clear. 6000 into 10 by 30. How do you calculate this one? 6000 into what is the second? 9. Multiply by 9, divide by 30. 30 is common for all the calculation in the first row. How did you get 30? I'll show you that. Depreciation, value of machinery, see, 10, 9, all the total is 30. Hope you are clear. Yes. Now, so like that you are supposed to calculate one by one, calculate everything for the first row, it is done. Come to second one, your rent. Rent, how do you calculate on the area of square feet? 5 plus 4, 9, plus 6, 15, 18, and 20. Hope you are clear. Yes. Similarly, 4 plus 2, 6, 9, 11, 12. So, 9, 11, 12. This is also 12. Similarly. So, calculate. First one, how to calculate? 12,000 multiplied with 5 divided by 20. Again, 12,000 multiplied with 4 divided by 20. And 12,000 multiplied with 6 divided by 20. And 12,000 multiplied with 3 divided by 20. 12,000 multiplied with 2 divided by 20. Like this, you are supposed to calculate. Hope you are clear. Good. This is your calculation. Similarly, calculate for everything. 12,000 into 2 by 12. 2,000 into 3 by 12. 3,000 into 2 by 12 and 2000 into 1 by 12. Like that, you are supposed to calculate everything. Easiest problem, but it takes much time. If you go wrong anywhere, your whole problem is wrong. That is very important. So, it is nothing but constructing a building. If anywhere you go wrong, wrong placement of stone, wrong placement of brick, what happened? The whole building will collapse. collapse. Similarly, here also, if you make mistake in anywhere, your final total will give you wrong result. Clear? Yes. Once you done, total, 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 and your final total. This much only your answer. This we call it as primary distribution. There are two things are there. One is primary and the one is secondary. Right now what we did, that is called primary distribution. Hope you got it. Yes, I'll go back to all the previous slides so that you can take a screenshot. Your problem number one. Your question part. Again, your solution part. Your solution. So this is all about your today's session. Hope you understood what is overhead and we worked out one complete problem on overhead. Before you start your problem, always remember the allocation. Rent goes for area occupied. Machinery goes for your value of the plant, value of the machine. Depreciation, all these things you are supposed to learn before you start your problem. Thank you.